Uh, so I want to take a little different tact on it. Everybody knows uh, what the problem is. I think uh, today, though, uh, is, for me, about something else. Uh, it shows us that leadership actually matters. This place hasn't been working for a long time. Whether you want to talk about uh, uh, the budgeting process, uh, whether you want to talk about uh, getting uh, appropriations bills uh, passed, we talk about this all the time, that the process is 12 appropriations bills out of the House, out of the Senate, across the President's desk, on or before midnight on September 30th every year. And the last time that happened, I think Bill Clinton might have still been in office. Uh, leadership matters. And what you saw today is this is the reason why Republicans put Kevin McCarthy in the position as Speaker of the House. Uh, there is a new uh, environment that is here, and uh, this is a McCarthy-led House that literally is saying it's time for us to all sit down despite our differences, get rid of the metal detectors, get your butts back to work, get into a room with one another and have a, a really serious discussion about the reason we all ran for Congress. We came here to make a difference. You can't make a difference on your own. You got to do it with other people. And Kevin McCarthy has literally started to bring both sides of this, all sides, because it's not that easy anymore. It's not just both sides. Brought them all together. I think today is a great example of the leadership. And I want to thank you, Kevin. I want to thank Jody for uh, his on the budget chair, too. But what Kevin has done is started the process, hopefully, of healing that's going to allow us to work together and try to solve the biggest problem that faces this nation's uh, present and future. And I, again, I want to thank uh, uh, the speaker for his great work. And I turn it over to our conference chair, Elise Stefan.